let's go into game three, this map ban. Um, and that pick goes to Mob. Mob has picked Bank Heist. Excuse me, that's not a ban, that's a pick. They've picked Bank Heist. So we will go ahead and play on that map with Commando Delta on the defense. And when we come back, I will go ahead and give you their records on that map. So we will see you in game three. So we're just going to go ahead and we're ready to go. So let's watch. For Mob, it's going to be Father Mods, the one Tony Montana, Follick and Eagle, Medtech, and Just Chili against Commando Delta's Flex, Hendrix, Crusader 72, Slay X, and Artist. Noticing, too, Commando Delta, they've all gone with armor. They've all gone with Kyanites in this first defense round. Or they've used them all up, not all of them. There is, they, there is limited resources of the stuff, but they have used them all up. Deploying in 10 seconds. There goes the power. That'll make sure the gates don't come up for the attacking team mob, but Tony Montana and Father Mods will use that underground tunnel entrance. We'll see if anyone from Commando Delta will greet them. It looks like Crusader is the one, and he sees the shield, holds on to the to pull in the trigger there. Other mods will probably give that information out because he does see that. We'll nade out there, but it takes a bad bounce. And I don't think Crusader has any clue that Tony Montana is also there. That nade is going to go out there and might land right next to Crusader. It actually just misses him. Crusader tries to take a lot of shots to his right. Has the trouble of three mob members now. Down to 33 health. Now he's going to get some kind of support here from Hendrix. Hendrix will get Tony Montana, who is out and overexposed, too focused on Crusader. It is 2v2 in the underground parking lot. Nade goes out and Father Mods is down to 45 health because... The shield was on his back as he took out the pistol, trying to get those shots in on Crusader. And Hendrix, with a nice angle on just Chili, will give Commando Delta the advantage down here. Other uh, mods down there is going to relocate. He's down to 14 health. Flylick and Eagle has entered in on the second floor conference hall. Medtech is still peaking multi-purpose hall. And a flex will get fly like an eagle. Just Medtech and Father Mods left as Flex, well, it's just Father Mods left as Flex gets Medtech. You don't usually see teams like to push through Underground Tunnel because of this funnel it creates that's really tough to push through on this map, and this might just prove it here. Ah, uh, Crusader is not hitting his shots here. Other mods has had 14 health since before that engagement. Crusader is down to 3 health. I believe Hendrix has pushed up. Hendrix has pushed up. Still focus on the left side. I don't think Commando Delta also realizes it's Father Mods left. Now they do. As Commando Delta takes round number one, defending in Bank Heist. Flex, Hendrix, and Crusader 
all picking up at least a kill there in that round for mob uh the best damage done was fly like an eagle with 73 followed by father mods 65 damage Artist out of breath. He's going to go upstairs. Uh, first floor, the central vault is where Commando Delta is going to choose to defend in round number two. Crusader is going to rush down there to cut the power in the parking garage. And I don't believe anyone from Mob is... No, no one from Mob is choosing Underground Tunnel this time. I didn't mention before, too. Like That's just a spot that's really tough to push through. You don't see a lot of people actually even try to go through... Underground tunnel, not in, in in competitive matches anyway. It might be one thing if you're you know playing a playing a public match where there's a lot of mixed abilities, but some of the best players in the game playing in the league here and funnels are dangerous, more dangerous in league play than in any other scenario. Oh, Tony Montana sees some toes, I think. I don't know whose toes he sees. I think he might see Flex's toes. And... Yeah, he's trying to identify. I'm sure he saw some movement or something, and is trying to see if he can find the feet. Uh, he might see it now. Oh, did you see the movement? Flex is down to 68 health. He's trying to figure out where he's getting shot from. <laughs> Crusader gets Father Mod. Slayx gets Med Tech. There you go. Flex is now down to 50 health. Still getting shot from underneath there. As so Wally Eagle gets Slayx. We're just missing the whole thing watching this. It's, it's 2v4. Now Flex backs away from that as his health is down to 50. And Flex is probably going to watch the replay going, where did this guy get me from? Tony Montana himself is down to... 60, Sabalic and Eagle gets Artist. Tony Montana's down to 62. Crusader with 20 health is up there looking up the top of the main stairs. Sabalic and Eagle is at the top of those main stairs coming down from the roof. Tony Montana is repelling now. So Montana's going up, Eagle's going down. Crusader's given up the main stairs entirely. That should make it easier for Eagle to push down and get a better position. He likes to use that M4. We see him go with that uh, a lot. And with the fire rate increase brought to you by Operation Magna, as Flex finally gets the kill back on Tony Montana. <laughs> That's the guy! <laughs> But uh, that fire rate increase on the M4 has made it a much better weapon to go with. And Flex will get Fly Like an Eagle from the long, long end of the hall. Nice job by Flex to get those last two kills. Flex is also leading Commando Delta in kills after two rounds. Flex, Hendrix, and Crusader have yet to be killed two rounds into this game. Fly Like an Eagle have, has the only two kills for his team. All right, so second floor uh, chairman's uh, office is going to be the round three objective spawn. For Commando Delta, it's so important for them to win their defenses. And they are doing just that here. See, just Chili spawned in on the roof coming down. His father mods gets a good shot on Artist. Takes two. But he gets it done.
right in front of Flex is going to be Just Chili, who pops out to take him out. Just Chili didn't get all hurt all that much. He's got 88 health on him. Crusader's coming up the power stairs with the sawed-off shotgun, and he's going to just see Just Chili! The Slay-X gets Medtech, evening it up, making it 3v3. Well, then Father Mods gets Slay-X. The way Slay X has been playing all season, that's like getting two kills. Oh, Hendrix did not see Fly Like an Eagle at all. And even with the late pickup, still gets Fly Like an Eagle, though it brings him down to 10 health. Tony Montana comes up. He'll come up and get Crusader. Down to 20 health himself. And it's down to Hendrix. It's 10 HP versus 120 HP. Hendrix is now going to have to come out there. Tony Montana cancels the, the fuse. And coming out is going to be Father Mods. But Tony Montana will take care of business on his own. Taking round number three. Teams will swap sides. For Commando Delta, it is four kills for Flex and Crusader. Three kills for Hendrix and two kills for Slay X. While like an Eagle... Not pick up any kills in that round, but still tied with two kills with the one Tony Montana and Father Mods who picked up two each in that round. And just Killy who got one. Oh. Planning table to find the bomb. Uh I mentioned before that uh Mob had a sixteen point seven percent um round win on attack on this map that's a mistake i meant to say 16.7 percent round win on this map period they have no attack round wins leading into this game until the one they just got last time when they uh faced chimera crew on this map they only won one round and that came on defense as flex will get tony montana from the stairs, this is probably one of the best angles to hold on attack on this map. Medtech just sees enough there, but yeah, he keeps looking away from it. Fly like an eagle will get the entry kill on Slay X. Oh no, actually, excuse me, Commander Delta got a kill first. Uh, Father Mods gets a kill on Artist. That was actually not an entry kill. Uh, Hendrix will now start to push in. Medtech still trying to... Okay, yeah, now that the Swamp Peak Barrier is down, he's going to throw an 8 in there, avoiding the frag death as Flex will get Medtech pushing down... The uh, power stairs. Father Mods will come in to support this power stairs here, uh, push with just Chili. Actually, Father Mods is on the front lines here now. It's just Chili that's on the support. And coming down the ramp is fly like an eagle. Father Mods will get Hendrix, and yep. I was just about to say, too, if Flex peeks out of there, he's probably going to be dead with the angle that Eagle was holding, and that is exactly the case. Ooh. This is a tight angle for Crusader to hold, and he's got the pistol. He's gonna have to get his shot spot on. He's getting pushed in on the left side, and the right side, and up the middle. That's... Oh, he's gonna get... Yep, circled around on shield coming in on him, and Flyak Eagle will support pushing in 
to get Crusader, it is tied 2-2. Round five coming up. Use the planning table to find the bomb. And Commando Delta, I, I, the the thing that they need to work on is getting the attack wins. I, I mean, every, like I said before, every team has a better record defending than attacking. But it's just every team is just doing that much better than Commando Delta on attacking. And we saw how well they did getting that win on Residential House. Which seems to be a map they're doing, you know, very well at. We would like to maybe see them, you know, maybe pick up a few more attack wins on some other maps. Ooh! Oh, that's so dirty! I love this spot, by the way. Crusader gets the entry kill on Father Mods, and Flex will get the kill on the 120 Montana. Covering the top of those stairs once again. While, like, an Eagle will get Slay X. Playing from the bathrooms. A lot of people forget to check that little gap by the ramp. That uh, Crusader just picked up the kill off of. Artist is going to go unopposed in the garage. But uh, this camera's... Dodging his bullets. He did eventually get that camera. Oh, and punching up jets! Wow! <laughs> Just rushing, ignoring where Flying Eagle could be. Crusader gets a kill on Medtech with the pistol. But Flex was like mid sprint before he had to stop and shoot at Flying like Eagle. Ask and you shall receive. We wanted to see some more attack wins from Commando Delta. Well, I mean, it's maybe a little too early to call it still, but it's 4v1. Advantage Commando Delta. As we're approaching two minutes in round number five. Just Chili has a lot of good defensive positions around him. And even though it's 4v1, he's really only got like one or two guys in front of him. Because the other two are, are clearing behind. And this angle right here might be lethal. Whoever that is coming down the main stairs, that's Crusader. Oh, but if Just Chili just focuses on it. No, he looked away. That, yep, now Crusader picks up Just Chili. If Chili was just looking there for a second more. Oh, no, the nerd! Crusader avoids it. Just Chili will get the kill on Artist. Now he's got trouble coming up from behind him. He thinks it's just the shield. There's a lot more trouble out there than that. Crusader gets taken out by Just Chili's frag. And to his left, he's got to worry about Flex. To his right, he's got to worry about Hendrix. Hendrix is going to come in not aggressively enough, maybe. As Just Chili has got trouble on the right, but now he's looking left. And he's going to charge Flex again, Flex! It's just going to be Hendrix left! This will be a clutch against four if Just Chili pulls this off. And Hendrix needs a gun. I, I don't know that you're going to... I mean, Just Chili also has a lot of health. Look at it. He's got 80 health. The onus is on Hendrix to get the defuse with 45 seconds left. And Just Chili can just sit back and wait. Now catching Hendrix on the retreat, who still doesn't have a weapon. I mean, well, he's got a shield, but doesn't have a gun. Picking up that shotgun now. I'll have to go around to the front by the queue. Oh, 30 seconds. 30 seconds remain. Hendrix might be in trouble if Just Chili just holds this angle here. Now Hendrix will push in on the vault. Just Chili's gonna come back out and just all oh, peek a little bit too much for Hendrix to get the kill. And Commando Delta will get the lead here. 3 2. Oh, wow. The bomb is.
Just gave a little too much. Coming up next after this game is going to be 1-9 at Chimera Crew. Chimera Crew needs one more win to clinch first place in the inaugural season. That'll be coming up next at the conclusion of this game. And for Commando Delta, you see Flex has eight kills, three deaths. Crusader has six kills, three deaths. On Mob, you have six kills for Fly Like an Eagle. And four kills each for Father Mods and just Chili. I know Delta's been doing very well. In round number six, they will be doing their final attack of this match. Second floor conference hall. That's not a common defense spot, but Mob will take it the as the attackers now spawn in. Mob is just holding their positions. You see behind the desk is medtech, but everyone else is off-site. They're trying to prevent the entry. And medtech is the, is the only one that's going to, you know, give information to the rest of his team. He's probably seen to and going to let them know. Meaning his teammates that there's trouble on site. Ooh, the 120 Montana just got a kill there on Slay X with a tap there. And Medtech will get Crusader. It is 3v5. Hey guys, if you want to get that uh, sweatband you see on the wrist of Just Chili here, use exclamation point ZH code in chat, and you can use that code in the in-game Zero Hour store. And that'll unlock the, uh, the try-hard sweatband for you is for the expedition community all you fine folks who love watching these competitive games in zero hour hendrix takes some shots there with that shield i would think he's got a frag on him in his second utility slot his first utility slots the c2 getting pushed from behind that's going to force hendrix to give his back to the stairs where medtech will get that kill and it's now two v5 well 1v5 as like an eagle gets artist but flex will get fly like an eagle back a lot of action on the third floor for an objective objective that's on the uh second floor and father mods will come up from the rear to get flex tying it up 3-3 Fly like an eagle with seven kills, Father Mods with five. For Commando Delta, you have nine kills for Flex. Take a look at the damage these two guys are doing. Flex with over 1,100 damage, Fly like an eagle with over 1,200 damage, almost 1,300 damage. They are really getting it done. All right, now we have Mob coming in to attack. Commando Delta did not cut the power with a basement spawn. Now they do. I think that was a mistake. I don't know that that was intentional. Yeah, you can't crawl through here unless the garage door goes up a little bit more.
Artist is going to get med tech. Father Mods is going to take some shots here towards the, from the end of the hall as Artist gets just chilly. Oh, the nade is perfect by Father Mods to get Artist back. Someone has pushed out, it said? Oh, that's Flex. Yeah. Where Flex is standing is marked as being outside the building when you cross that yellow line. And we've seen sometimes players use that to bait the attacking team to come check it out. And it looks like Fly Like an Eagle might be going for it. See, there's that hole right there. When you go inside that manhole, that takes you back into the underground tunnel entrance. But a, a little known fact. I don't think he actually is going to take it, though. Unless he's just trying to clear around this. Okay, he is going to take it. As Father Mods will get Slay X, and Slay X will get Father Mods in return for the trade. 2v3. Yeah, so Fly Like an Eagle has gone down the manhole. He is now underground where Flex is just letting himself be the bait. And Eagle is being so quiet here that Flex might just be a free kill. Maybe he doesn't want to tempt it. Now coming out. Yep. Fly Like an Eagle. Gets Flex, who had no idea Eagle was coming. Didn't hear him. Crusader is looking away. Okay, there we go. Now he sees where Fly Like an Eagle's at. Fly Like an Eagle's down to 22 health. Coming down the power stairs is the one Tony Montana. Hendrix is looking at main stairs. Crusader has to split his sights between both the underground tunnel entrance and the power stairs. Ooh, just a little late there. And Tony Montana will come out to get Crusader. It's going to be Hendrix left defending on site. Just over a minute left. Hendrix is going to hold a good angle here, but with 60 seconds left, Mob might have plenty of time to take Hendrix out and defuse. If they realize they have the advantage, the man advantage to push, they might not even realize it's 2v1 right now. Nade going out by Hendrix. Mob might be wasting a little bit too much time if Hendrix can stay alive. And Nade goes out there. Hendrix is at 58 health and a clear of that nade. Eagle will probably peek out here as Tony Montana starts to defuse. Here comes Hendrix inching out. And they are not getting each other. Hendrix is down to 40 health. He's got to get up and take it out. He can't. The bomb is defused. Mob is up by 1-4-3. For Mob, it's Father Mods with seven kills, Father like an Eagle with eight kills, Tony Montana and just Chili with four kills each, and four. Commando Delta, you have nine kills for Flex, six for Crusader. Crusader joining the four digit damage crew. Father like an Eagle, for 1400 damage, just continues to impress. First floor, Central Vault is going to be Commando Delta's second defense for the second ha the second time of their defense. I guess you could say fifth defense of the game. Locate and defuse the bomb. If Commando Delta can win this round and the next, it will be their first series win of the season. He just chillies, sees the trouble on the other end, and just trying to get the quick peek there. But Artis will be the one getting the kill against just chilly. Eagle cannot get the angle to support and get just chilly. Who, excuse me, just chilly was the one that got killed. My artist was the, is the one that we're looking for. Yes, there he is right there. Now.
Now, Eagle has found a better angle. Artist has got to deal with the shield push coming up on the right side. You see Tony Montana's in the underground tunnel. Father Mods has perfect sights on Artist, just has nothing to shoot with. He's gonna charge Artist. All Artist has for his first utility slot is the flare. Oh! Avoids the flash! Tony Montana will get Crusader. Artist doesn't pay attention to Father Mods coming out with the shield and gets taken out. Hendrix will shoot fly like an eagle. I wonder from where. Father Plotic and Eagle must have rappelled down from one of the sides because he was just up on the roof a moment ago. Point man is Father Mods with that shield, avoiding getting shot at, avoiding the explosive, now having to come back out. And he's going to throw a frag out. That frag bounced back. I don't think. Oh no, he got it! Yep, and it gets flexed in the process. Ooh, Hendrix also just sees a piece. Metech will be coming in from multi-purpose hall. And pushing over to Slay X's left is going to be the shield. Where Hendrix is looking at the back entrance. Nade going out. And shield will return back in. Montana gets Hendrix. And Montana gets Father Mods. His, his teammate. Oh no. And Slay X will get Montana. The nade did not go out. That's another friendly fire kill for Montana. It's 1v1. Both of them have full health creeping over here. 60 seconds left approximately. And Slay X gets medtech. Using the body of the shield bearer for cover. It's going to come down to the ninth round. The winner of this round will win this game. And if it's Commando Delta, it'll be their first series win this uh, this season. And for Mob, they just want to keep the gap twice, or excuse me, the gap close. Don't know where twice came from. They want to keep it close between them and 1-9. At the start of this series, only one game separated the two of them. They now have the same amount of wins as 1-9 does. Still a losing record, 6-7. and seven, Or excuse me, 6-8. Uh, and eight. Yes, six and eight. But at least they can keep it tight if Mob will pull a win here. And Crusader's going to wait to the last second to flip the switch here. Locate and the bomb. As he does now. So this is a second floor chairman's office objective hold. A little over a minute in, Spawn Peak Barrier is down, and... Wallach and Eagle is outside, but the rest of Mob is inside. A three-stack coming in through the rear staircase. Wallach and Eagle outside that rear staircase. I think they're trying to reposition themselves here. And uh, for Commando Delta, they're just holding their positions as they do when they defend. They know... That mob needs this just as much as they do to defend on site. They're just going to keep holding it. And Father Mods will pick up a shield kill on Artist.
Commando Delta holds one side of this map. Mob is holding the other side. Behind them is going to be Fly Like an Eagle, but I don't know that he's going to have an angle from down there to get anybody. Flex is trying to see if he can just squeeze a shot in there against the shield carrier, Father Mods. And you see Mob is moving more slowly, more methodically, trying to see if they can pick... Oh, no, the nade! Montana gets Slay X, though. They're trying to pick off Commando Delta one at a time, and that is working for them, and that's generally how... Attacks work. Successful attacks work. He's just picking off the defense one at a time. Hendrix will not get down and get uh, taken out by Father Mods. Just Chili gets taken out by Flex. It is Crusader, the lone defender. All of Commando Delta gets taken out. It is 5v0. Time continues because it is less than... Uh, less than a minute and 20 seconds. But they should know they have five kills. And Mob will take game number three. Nine round game and Mob takes it. Father Mods with double digit kills here, 11 and 5. While like an Eagle and the 120 Montana has nine kills and six kills, both over a thousand damage. Father Mods had a lot of the, his, his damage isn't as high because a lot of his kills came from the shield.